Hi, I'm Lexi, and welcome. I just wanted to share with you a bit of my story today. In 1997, I was diagnosed with breast cancer. <clears throat> Since then, I've been learning a lot and reading a lot about what to eat and what not to eat so that I keep a healthier body for the rest of my life. I did go to a two-week retreat, a raw food retreat in 2008, and it taught me a lot. Um, it's one of the reasons why I do eat raw food now and green smoothies. I don't believe in microwaves. I don't have a microwave in my house. I never will. The research that I've done, I believe, is to be true, is once you put liquid or food into the microwave, it reduces the nutri nutrient content to 5% or less. So I do everything the old-fashioned, old-school way. <laughs> it takes a little longer, but I don't mind. I do eat a lot, of, a lot of raw food. Things that I've taken out of my diet are dressings, sauces, gravies, butter, margarine, all sorts of things like that. And honestly, I'm really glad that I have. I am a breast cancer survivor now of, what, 18 years or so? And I want to keep that trend going. And I'm glad I'm here to talk about it. I'm glad I'm here to talk to you about it. The events leading up to me getting breast cancer was, I do believe, it was my unhealthy lifestyle. First of all, I was working shift work. <clears throat> I was not getting enough sleep and I was not eating properly. I <clears throat> realized not long after that that there was a lot of stress in that lifestyle as well. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I realized that stress is a big indicator that there's things wrong with your body and it does cause a lot of things and in my case I believe it caused breast cancer. I just wanted to tell you this today because I hope it's valuable for you. I don't want to see anybody go through what I went through. I just want to give you value and hope that you want to live a healthier life, a long life, in a healthy way. Um, I'm glad you watched this video today. Thank you, thank you for your time and make it a great day.